that. First alert, Chief Meteorologist Scotty Paget. Friday night, everybody's wondering it's going to be 115 tomorrow, 120. No. Where are we going? We're, we're going down a little bit. We like that. We like that. And it's going, that trend continues into next week, Doug. So today, hottest day of the year, hottest day in 12 years. Tomorrow, we have an alert in place. It's going to be another record day. 107 is the forecast. 20% precip chances, record 106, set back in 2011. But then by Sunday, 103, record 107. So not a record on Sunday. Sunday, and then on Monday, a 30% chance of maybe some spotty showers around. Look at that high temperature of 96 degrees. But our alert continues through Saturday. Excessive heat warning until 9 o'clock for tomorrow in place. That feels like temperature as high as 112. Critical fire threat also continuing. No reason to do any outdoor burning at all. Here's the excessive heat warning. All of North Texas remaining under that excessive heat warning uh, just over the state line in Oklahoma under a heat advisory. So pretty much what you saw today, we have the potential of those feels like temperature up to 112 or even 113 in some spots and the actual temperature between 104 and 108. Miss Marsha, I know you're watching right now. Look at that 95 degrees by Tuesday. So we have temperatures cooling their way on down. Thanks to finally a cold front moving its way on in. Now, the first alert visible satellite and radar combined right now showing not a whole lot happening. Eastland County, a couple of spotty showers just south of 20, making their way down towards the west southwest. Uh, we have seen temperatures cool down to the mid 90s right now. We're at 96 degrees, not a lot of humidity to talk about, so only feeling like 97 with a southeast wind holding on near 5 to 10. Across the Metroplex, we're at 98 still at Love Field, 88 though Mesquite to 92 and Denton to 93. In Bridgeport, across North Texas, same story. So we're cooling our way down. It's going to be another night tonight where our temperatures cool their way down into the mid 80s uh, because this uh, heat dome is still sitting overhead. It really kept the center portion of the country very hot as we went through the day today. So this heat dome does make its way back towards the west as we go into Saturday and then into Sunday. The upper level flow turning northerly. What that means for you is that front's allowed to sink its way on in late tomorrow night uh, and then going into Sunday. So tonight, low to the mid 80s to the upper 70s in some spots. As we go through tomorrow, just pay attention. Again, an alert in place up to 107 as the high, but your first alert seven-day forecast shows the front moving through and then cooling us down. Rain chances 30% Monday to Monday night. We have 95 on Tuesday, Wednesday 96, but pay attention to this. Morning temperatures in the low 70s as we round out next week. You're watching us right here on CBS News Texas. We'll be right back.